video is made possible by 343 Studios. Hey everybody, what's going on? Nathan343 here. And if you all seen some videos last week, you probably saw that I went to GIE Equipped Expo slash Equipped Exposition in Louisville, Kentucky, the big lawn care expo. And yes, I picked up a couple things while I was there. So I want to show them off a little bit. I'm actually on my way to go do some um, plug aerating. We finally got some rain softened the ground up enough. And uh, picked up a couple things there, a couple things I don't think are gonna ship for a while for some reason, but uh, I want to show you this part. So this is the um, equipmentdefender.com. This is the backpack blower. This is the V2, so this is the second version. I put this together all by myself. Feel pretty good about it. It looks really good. Very simple to put together. Um, it is a backpack lock. As you can see, it has a lock here for your backpack blowers. Now I can suck these down a little bit here. Uh, it's got the uh, padding here. It's got a bar right here. It's actually got another bar for some. Some uh, backpack blowers have a deal here. So you can actually attach it here and it will help keep it down in there. This is adjustable. This is the locking bar here. I'll show you how that works. And then it has a holder for the blower um, tab. So that's pretty cool. It's got this is adjustable for any size different uh, or any different sized um, leaf blower. So I've never heard of these people. Saw them there at the GIE Expo slash equipped exposition. This is the uh, steel BR 800C. Yes, it will fit the 800s barely, but it will fit it. Um, I could more than likely probably bring this back or bring it forward. Um, a little bit, not a whole lot. I might end up bringing it forward just a little bit once we kind of play around with it. We may end up loosening these up and scooting it up just a little bit. We've got a little bit of room there that it could, as you can see, hold. Um, but the blower itself is moving, but not the actual, I mean, it's not coming out. So this is for theft. This is for keeping your equipment safe while you're out mowing, while you are out doing lawn care landscaping. Now, this is just a quick latch system. So it has a deal here, pop this open, it has a key lock. It does come with two keys. You can opt out for a combination lock. This is just a cover. So you just pull that down. So how to get this out, as you this push this up, flips around like so, just a little locking deal. That hangs down this off, so it has a couple little deals here that you put so it holds it and then you can pull out the backpack now i'll go ahead and take the backpack out for you and i am doing this one-handed so give me a second my, my backpack this out. is now free so then what happens is when you lock it you just flip this around and it's a simple slam lock they call it now this is adjustable it adjusts in different different um areas it probably does this here it probably needs to be loosened up and pulled back this way because you basically want this to be right up alongside of that i need to do some adjusting here this is adjustable it adjusts with screws it locks uh, this is to keep weather out keep it from rusting it's not really waterproof it's just a deal all their racks come with this i am switching to equipment defender we had the yellow ones over there the weed eater racks from I think those were Northern Tool. Those were what used to be uh, Green Touch is stuff. Now they're they're green. They were yellow. They're green now. But uh, this is adjustable here. You can slide this up and down. Some people leave it down. Some people leave it up. I figured go a little higher. You've got some protection here. I thought about putting a piece of metal here to here so that I can, um, you know, make some security there. I could build some sort of what do you call it? This is also made to how you would mount it to a enclosed trailer. It comes with all the screws. It comes with everything, literally everything. I had to drill some extra holes. I was able to use two holes out of this. Um, I am going to make something come off the side of the trailer here but this I'll winter. I'll be making a little bracket here that sticks out so that I can, probably a little flat piece of metal that I can weld right here so I can put a little you know, a, a screw down in there to hold that. So we're gonna put a flat piece of metal in it's there. Awesome. Well, you just flip it up, 
there goes your deal and then you just slam lock it now i'm going to go ahead and set up a camera just to show you how easy it is to put a backpack blower in here what i do i grab the backpack blower set it up in there i take this put it down in the deal the tube kind of Two down where it's supposed to. Get this lined up. First, this here. Okay, I'm sorry if I'm blocking the camera. Put that underneath there. Wrap this around here. Kind of gets the out of the way, get it centered. That down in there, make sure the cables not being pinched. Okay, take the bar, wrap it around. Mm -hmm get to sit in there right sometimes you have to grab the tube and force it back just a little bit grab the deal hold it forward and it's locked i'll do that over here on this side so you can see that a little better backpack blower is in there come around lock it in it's a slam lock it also has a key to lock it which even when i'm not got a backpack blower in here it will be locked so very cool they also have these uh, made for the sprayer backpacks that have the the sprayers on them i really really like it it's not going very much looks like it's very well built i like that they have their name on there that's awesome so yeah here is a clip of equipment defender from the equip exposition gie expo as it was known hope you enjoyed don't forget to like comment and subscribe stay tuned for more videos from them or more products from them i guess you would say and we'll see you in the next one when you're ready to order just let me know and matt will take you okay. take care of it. How's it going? I'm a I'm a steel runner. Okay. I run lots of steel. steel. Actually, this is my backpack blower, except that it's just a regular backpack blower. Yeah, you can flip right on the jowl. That's nice. You're talking to the That's on the market. Is this new this year? Oh. I like it because it balances know, the weed. Yeah, from day one. Yeah, it just cool. When you put it back in here, you see the square shape of the receiver on this end completely eliminates any spinning in the rack. So there's no flooded engine, spilled fuel, or any of those problems. Right now, it appears to, I mean, it's not really yet, locked, but all three positions are kind of locked in there, but not really. That makes it really fast and easy. Most thieves will never figure out how to get this out, but you're not wasting the time to dig a key out of your pocket or manipulate a combination lock. This rack comes with a keyed lock, but they do they are available with a combination Gym supports also. very so, fast and easy to get it all set up. So we designed a lock mechanism where there's a what people ask for is they wanted a really fast way to latch it and, and latch it in there. Rotate we done this manipulate, you can manipulate it in both directions here. Just lay it down there. Blower's ready to come out now. When you put the blower back in, the bar comes back across, and over here you basically have a simple slam latch, which it just locks in. You can leave, you can run it like that all day long if you wish. Or if you do have, feel like there's a theft issue, you go ahead and lock it right here. And again, you can put a combination lock in in place of the key lock. Hey guys, Matt, I'm the Defender here. I got a few yeah. new products that were double sided head trimmer rack. This will also fully adjustable and work with any chainsaw Still, on, or excuse me, head trimmer on the this rack. To use it, you've got your lock housing here that's built on the side. Same lock housing we use on our uh, backpack blower racks. Uh, you would just unlock it. And you've got the release mechanism here, so once you unlock it, you can't get this off with a combination lock. Uh, you're just going to pull up on this tab. 
clamp opens up, chainsaw comes out. You take your chainsaw, go to work, and you're done. It's going to grab right there. In these jaws, you're going to close the arm, clamps on the blade, and you can lock the rack right here. You can see here on the back of the rack that we designed this so it can mount to any style trailer rail. So you can mount to a round rail, an angled rail, a square rail right out of the box. Or you can mount it to an enclosed trailer using these mounting holes right here. Double right sided hedge trimmer rack. Again, the same lock housing that you can get with a keyed lock or with the optional combination lock. Same concept here. You're just going to push up. The clamps here release and your hedge trimmer can come right on out. We've got this nice adjustable support here at the top that the hedge trimmer clamps onto so you don't get any of that vibration as you go down the road. Uh, this is going to be $185. These are $165 on the chainsaw racks. We do also, we've heard a lot, we've had a lot of requests for handheld blower racks. This is a prototype. Uh, these will be available early next year. Again, we have our lock housing here that, you, that you'll be able to get with a keyed or a combination lock. And then this clamp comes down, grabs the top of the, the handle here. And again, this will fit any commercial handheld blower on the market with the echo over there. Still over here. Our uh, pole saw rack, this is also coming out. Uh, will be available for purchase here at the show. I don't know the price on this. I have to finish figuring that out. Uh, but this will mount to an open or enclosed trailer as well. Counting holes are going to be right out. Uh, for enclosed trailers, they, they're uh, not needed. You can mount right to the wall. And then, like I said, we still have you know our hand, held, uh, hand, hand tool racks, enclosed trailer hand tool racks, water cooler racks, the trimmer rack over there line spool racks, basically now with the chainsaw, the head trimmer, and the pole saw rack, uh, we've got pretty much everything you would need to organize and secure your...